The Straight White Man's Guide to the 21st Century. My body is ready. What? This is on sitting in public interest, and, and this is the darkest white man I've ever seen. He's, he's borderline Indian. Oh yeah, I'm on BuzzFeed. They're about to pander and not actually talk about what they said they were going to talk about. None among us is blessed with balls so bulbous that they prevent him from physically closing his legs. First off, I don't care how bulbous or whatever his, his crotch is, right? Look at how much space is here right now. He could lay down there, take a nap, and she would have nothing to do with it. Mind your business, lady. And both of y'all need to get some damn sleep. What's with all the baggage? You're going on a trip? On offering explanations while male. He's about to say something that applies to both genders, but act like it only affects one, right? <laughs> oh my god, the cheekiness. The decorum here is simple. A gentleman never explains. I love this guy. He's the best. I, 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 if possible, if possible, I'd like to find out if there's somewhere I could donate money to him to carry on with his legacy. Nobody likes a ball. If you can't sum it up in a sentence or two, politely decline and ask them instead to download a Google. Yeah, Mike, remember last week we was like, hey, we should swan dive into the Grand Canyon. And I was like, nah, bro, we would totally die. Ready? My things are packed. Download a Google. Chance of survival. There's no chance of survival. I'm ready. After all, a gentleman never explains. I could have used that back in high school. Okay, but how did you arrive at this answer? A gentleman never explains. And how do you not know? Aren't you the teacher? This is your first day? You teach me, I don't teach you. On another note, what does this have to do with straight white men? Like, I'm, I'm so confused. Like, only straight white men do this. And how does this only apply to males? Like, so women don't go on for hours talking about stuff we don't care about? Your explanations don't have to be concise you don't have to like try and do it as quickly as possible without drawing out the conversation where i become bored i mean all men have to be taught not to be assholes and white men are born assholes right that's that's how that works buzzfeed let's be honest gents who hasn't had the gumption to take a snap of their john thomas and Telefax it what excuse me on dropping the atomic n-bomb uh, this, is, this is what I've been waiting for you was teasing the outer rim But now you're pushing it in okay. Okay. Let me see how much girth you got now chaps I know you love the hip-hop who are these chaps and what is the hip-hop? It is not now nor has it ever been appropriate for the straight white j wait a minute So gay guys can say it you learn something new every day. Don't get me wrong. There are some some um, good points being made in this article but when you like put some sprinkles on top of a piece of shit, right? It's still a piece of shit. Based on this article, it would just seem that white people hate their own existence, which is insane to me, and that should not be the case. Like this, this whole article is pandering as if only white males do a certain thing when both genders of any sexual orientation would, at some point, factor in. There would be a percentage. So, acting as if it's only white males that do asshole things it would seem like you guys just hate white males but then again i'm on buzzfeed and this is the same side that's saying tag yourself as a shoe and we'll accurately guess your zodiac sign i've lost enough iq points for the day i'm about to go beat my meat into a pink mist i'll catch you later <laughs>